Welcome back. Time is 6.55. And time to get you ready for these uh, with these top stories. I mean to say as you head out the door, Huntsville area COVID update from Dr. Pam Hudson from Crestwood Medical Center and other health leaders at noon today. And Wait 31 will stream that live for you at noon right here on air. Health leaders say another lockdown is not in Alabama's future. They say we all have the necessary tools to manage COVID, starting with vaccines. We also have some forms of treatments available in preventative measures like masking and washing your hands. Well, the Scottsboro City Council expected to vote on a rezoning plan. It is for the Goose Pond community. Developers want to build houses and apartments in that area, but that original vote was set for Monday. It is now moved to today. The Madison County man accused of setting multiple fires has a preliminary hearing at 10. Nicholas Hobart faces multiple arson and attempted arson charges. Police say he set 10 business fires throughout Madison County in late September. Carson. Plenty of sunshine for your Wednesday, but just a little bit cool. We're in the 30s right now, only heading for the upper 40s, close to 50 this afternoon. If you're a fan of the warmer weather, though, you're really going to like our seven day forecast. Take a look. Our warming trend begins tomorrow when we're back to near 60. Upper 60s Christmas Eve, lower 70s Christmas Day. Might be getting close to record territory this year. And those high temperatures staying in the 60s and close to 70 all the way through next week and possibly through the end of the year. For 24 7 coverage, you can count on it over to WayTV.com. Thanks so much for joining us this morning. Yeah, good morning, America. Up next, we are back every 30 minutes with local news and weather updates. Our first one coming up for you.